It's me again, Teacher Garner, and today we have a new topic. It's called What to Do with Electricity. Again, What to Do with Electricity. But before we continue with our lesson, we have some words to learn. First, plug. Again, plug. Let's spell plug. P L U G Plug Next word Unplug Again Unplug Let's spell unplug U N P L U G Unplug Of course unplug is the opposite of the word plug Last word Pairs. Again, pairs. Let's spell pairs. P A R E N T S. Pairs. Now, before we continue with our lesson, let's have a reminder first. Again, you need to be careful when using electricity. Now, our last topic was about what not to do with electricity. So, can you recall one? Okay, first, don't stick scissors, pens, fingers, or anything else into a main socket. Next, don't touch switches with wet hands. And last one, don't use electrical things near water. So those are the tips on what not to do with electricity. Now for this week's topic, it's called what to do with electricity. Here are some tips. Okay, first is do hold the plastic part of a plug when you plug or unplug it as you can see you need to hold the plastic part of the plug so as not to get electric shock here are some examples there you are always hold the plastic part of a plug when you plug or unplug it here's another one there you are that will keep you safe okay number two do ask your parents to help you with new electrical devices okay number two do ask your parents to help you with new electrical devices there you are always ask your parents if you are trying to use some devices at home or appliances okay don't ever do that that is very dangerous there last one if you need to use the computer and you don't know how to use it you have to ask your parents okay you ask to, uh, you need to ask for their help to help you use the computer or any good gadgets or any appliances
So what was the video all about? Yes, it's about uh, what are the causes of being too reckless with electricity or not being too careful with electricity. So for our review, number one, do hold the plastic part of a plug when you plug or unplug it. Just like in the picture, right? Again, do hold the plastic part of a plug when you plug or unplug it. Number two, do ask your parents to help you with new electrical devices. There you are. Do ask your parents to help you with new electrical devices. Now for our activity, Open your science books to page 73 and answer the activity. There you are. There you are on page 73. And here's an example. Again, you need to answer the activity on page 73. Okay. There's an example already. Okay, that wraps up our lesson for today. Thanks for watching. See you soon.